Hello, this is Ray Scarrett welcoming you to this service of night prayer. The date is Tuesday the 21st of July and I'm recording this service at home. So let's just make ourselves comfortable and sit quietly and focus our thoughts on God. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. Cast your cares on the Lord, and he will sustain you. Let's just sit in silence and reflect on this past day. Bring to mind all you've said, all you've done, and thought, for good or ill, and all those you've met or encountered, and rest in God's presence. Having collected our, th our thoughts, let's say together, Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed, and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit, and raise us to new life in Christ. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Our reading today is from the Gospel of Matthew. Jesus said, Come to me, all you that are weary, and are carrying heavy burdens, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Let's just think about that reading for a moment. So let's say together, Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people, Israel. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. So now we come to about a minute of silent prayer. And during that time, thank God for his presence and his patience with you throughout the day. If anyone or anything is troubling you, tell God about the situation. Ask him to help you to trust him and release you from the burden of anxiety. And I'll end this time of prayer with a colic.
eternal God, the light of the minds that know you, the joy of the hearts that love you, and the strength of the wheels that serve you. Grant us to, to so, so to know you that we may truly love you, so to love you that we may truly serve you, whose service is perfect freedom, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. And from our prayer calendar today, we pray for the Price family. That's Ash, Matt, Elsie and Emily. May they know God's blessing, his presence and his peace this night. And at this time, let's also bring to mind those who are lonely and those who are bereaved. And now let's join in the church family prayer. This is our prayer. Come, Holy Spirit, and make us one in heart and action, so that we can serve God faithfully, abounding in love, maturing in holiness, and seeking out the lost. Help us grow as disciples of Jesus, in commitment, in depth, and in number, that we may be a blessing to Amington, to the glory and praise of God the Father. Amen. The Night Prayer Lighten our darkness, Lord, we pray, and in your great mercy defend us from all perils and dangers of this night, for the love of your only Son, our Saviour, Jesus Christ. Amen. As our Saviour taught us, so we pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus. For the night is at hand, and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly on us and give us peace. Amen. 